We still haven't thought of an intro for this. Wham! I'm going with that. Wham! Wham! Welcome back to Wham! I thought Wham! Kiss FM. Wham FM. Wham FM. Wham, Wham FM. FM. <laughs> GM for G Minio. Wham GM. Three way high five. <laughs> Welcome back to Wham GM. What's GM? Wham Gum. G Minio. Wham Gum. <laughs> GM or FM? Killed her husband, whammed him. <laughs> it's 106.69 no G Minio. Let's play. All right, uh, we're back. Episode three of the podcast. What's crack a lacking, man? Uh, it is, what's today? Tuesday. <laughs> Wade's cranky. I'm not cranky. <laughs> I'm not cranky. Wade's vibes are weird today. I, know, I came right? in and what? I noticed a shift. Yeah. What? So it, it, he has like the he orange aura. I had like, snap at anybody. <laughs> Wade snapped at What did me. I say? You snapped. Yeah. What did I say? He punched me in the face. <laughs> this is not that true. was Wade snapping. None of this happened. And then he was kind of mean to me. And then we yeah. were both like, I think something yeah. was Wade. What did I do? After he and he kicked your face. shin guards too. Yeah, he kicked my I shin guards that I wear every day. Shin guards? I wear shin guards every day and yeah. we kicked them today. I thought that was just your leg. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I'm not upset. Wait there's nothing the wrong with me. I There's nothing Comment wrong. Comment section, cheer. let us know how we can cheer Wade up. I don't know what, what I did. What did I say? It was so mean. You didn't, you didn't say you it. Didn't it was mean. Exactly. I just, Wade's energy. We're just, we're just trolling. My chakra? Shifted. We're just trolling. I need to recenter my chakra. Your aura is orange, as Mark said. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't my know aura what that is either. orange. I just throw out a random color. I think orange might be happy. So your aura Wouldn't is Wouldn't it be yellow? Orange. No, orange for me is happy. University of Tennessee volunteers, baby. Orange oh, and white. Okay. Let's go. I go to Cal State Fuller, is it? I don't like it there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like Not it. Not proud. There. <laughs> no Cal State Fullerton pride for Mark. <laughs> Mark. But they're an also angry orange. Titan. <laughs> My colors are green for G Minio. <laughs> I thought what is what was, what's the other color? That blue. Was white? It's turquoise. Teal. Yeah. Oh yeah, blue and teal. No, it's not teal. Oh wait, I'm sorry. Green and teal. No, it's not teal. It's Andrew, teal. It's teal. Well, it's it's like it's a teal, blue you're green. Insane. You know, like what was your college? I'm sorry, you're in a bad mood. Thirty percent of men are colorblind. (laughs) I believe it. Mark with a (laughs) random stat. Mark's random stat of the day: (laughs) colorblind men. Okay, it's Tuesday. Um, What do we got going on today? We had yesterday. We did um, Haley. Haley edited. (laughs) <laughs> the diva video which is one of the funnier that videos was hilarious. i showed kelsey that video last night it was so funny she kelsey doesn't play a lot of like overwatch and stuff and she even was like on the mark train she was like i don't know how people play this and don't get like sick so there's, that's just there's, the way that's the way i play it though she was watching my gameplay but then again i, I like it's actually just, i move less than the yeah you move less yeah. than i should yeah <laughs> and most of the time i'm just standing there so maybe <laughs> So Maybe she was. I should just watch my gameplay. She was watching it. She had a fun time with that one. Um, so she got sick. But she no, she did say she was like, "How come people play yeah. this? Like, I would get sick playing it." Yeah. So that's two for the sick crew, Mark. Yeah. Two for the sick crew. <laughs> you and Kelsey. Two sick crew. You and Kelsey. <laughs> Mark and we Kelsey. We should we should play together and we'll alternate at half point. <laughs> You're like those those drunk girls in like club bathrooms that go in and they hold each other's hair <laughs> while they throw up. Yes, that's me and Kelsey. <laughs> <laughs> Kelsey one time had to I got sick like years ago uh, and Kelsey will hate me telling the story but I got sick years ago oh, no. and uh, I was having this bad day man like I was I was being mean not to her but I, I like I remember I got almost got in a fight with a guy in a car what because oh I was just feeling really bad I was sweating and he was like you know how people drive out here he was like cutting me off and stuff and long story short we got back to the house and Kelsey never seen me throw up Ever. You turns threw out I had, up because you were so mad? Well, I was sick. It turns out I had the stomach <laughs> flu, oh, and no. I ended up throwing up, and I threw up so much, and she can't stand throw up. Like, she cannot stand being around people that puke. And I was throwing up. Stuff was coming out of my nose. It was bad. And she was like, <laughs> I turn around, and she's outside of the bathroom door with just her hand out with, like, Pepto Bismol. Oh. <laughs> she's all, here oh, you go. That's so cute. <laughs> here it is. Here. She's like, okay, I got to This is like when we first started dating. She's like, I got to go. She's like, I have plans. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, somehow, oh yeah, it was out of the out of the, the gameplay we watched yesterday. So Haley edited that. That's very funny. Obviously, check that out on the channel as well. I'll put a card. Yes. <laughs> today, what do we got going on today? We're doing this podcast. I'm editing a video. Yeah. We have the tournament picks coming up soon. Tournament yeah. picks are coming up. We're so do that on draft Wednesday. pick. Yeah. Draft day. Yeah. Any uh, any outlying 
names that we want to that we want to maybe tease? Anything that you guys are looking at? Well, I was we had this conversation uh, previously, but Wade's editing that video, so I think it's gonna get cut out. But uh, there was someone who wanted to be on my team that was a grandmaster. Oh and, yeah, that's uh, getting cut out. And <laughs> that's getting cut out. And Wade and Andrew and Mark said that I could not have them on my team. You understand the reason. No, I think it's discriminatory towards people who are going to Overwatch. Good and great are very different terms. People that are good at Overwatch can play in our tournament. People that are very good to the point they're great, as you're, in you're they can play. Of smoke. I'm not afraid. I'm, I would lose. I know that. But I'm saying <laughs> everybody would have a terrible experience. Let me read here. A terrible experience when one person can stop the entire lobby. You know who wouldn't have a bad experience? That one person. And me. <laughs> so this time around, we we're excited sure though. I think I think Team Hog is going to take it. Obviously, I've had my eye on some of you guys in the no. chat. Uh, I'm not going to say who yet because strategy. Yeah, but, Team Suck has no chance. <laughs> uh, team Suck, <laughs> Team Hog, Team Tires, Team Tires, and Andrew. What's your team again? Ninjas. Ninjas. Team Ninja. That's team right. Ninjas. Lame. Andrew's Ooh. team is a bunch of five year olds going trick or treating. So. Uh, <laughs> So yeah, so that's that's coming up. Um, we're excited about it. Um, what else? I think every time Andrew talks on our podcast, we're we like, Boo. Up <laughs> get out <Shut> of here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so let's officially kind of say this on the Let's Play. So it's not really gonna be on the Let's Play, but it'll be on the the main G Mania channel. Yeah. yeah. Uh, July thirty first, we will do our second Slumber Party stream. Uh, PJs. I've got my own onesie that I had it at, at from from DreamHack. I have a, a while to buy a onesie this time. I'm not yeah. gonna wear a onesie. It's too it hot in here. Very it was hot. very hot. We yeah. might we might need to look at doing like yeah. shorter sleeve pajamas. I'm gonna wear what I wore. Or something. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Mark had his Mark had his Mark had his silk on. He had yeah. his he had his silk sheets <laughs> That's all nice. woven into a shirt. <laughs> silk sheets. <laughs> okay. So our first question today is from Alpha Wolf. Oh, AKA, Alpha. AKA the sponsor. The sponsor. The sponsor. <laughs> sponsor. What's up, Alpha? <laughs> okay, for the Q&A, we know how you all met, but how did you get here? Like, what are your goals, dreams, dream jobs, or interests, other than Wade being Iron Man, since I already took that role? So Facts. Alpha's got what is, a... What is the path of our lives? Alpha's got a sick car. We have Alpha to, has a sick car. You guys, if you're in the Discord, you got to check out Alpha's car. He's got, like, this Iron Man clad, red and, and yellow... Just nasty looking car. So he is really truly cool. Iron Man. So Very I'll give cool. you I'll give you that. Um Haley, you wanna start? What are your goals and dreams? <laughs> I know what mine so like, I don't think that far I'm ahead. Like, well, before I apply to college counselor, <laughs> um I I don't know. Well before this I was kind of like I had like a bunch of things that I was thinking about doing because I had just graduated from college. Like what? Um I applied to the UN. I had an interview with them. The United Nations? Yeah, the United Nations. Wow. I was wow. going to... That was going to be in Korea. Because my original plan was just to go to Korea after I graduated, mm -hmm. so I could really work on the language. Um, and then... I Well, I, I actually haven't told this story yet. I don't think you know either, but I met someone through... I went to, like, a Korean language exchange mm -hmm. where I was... Uh, you talk about the Korean language exchange, Yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't know the story. And I met someone there. The first day I went, the first day I went, I met someone there who knew Jui, our boss. Mm. And um, and so I met him once, and then I never saw him again. And right. it was the first day I went, and we, we kind of talked about stuff. And, um, and then he, one day, Andrew and Jui were getting coffee, and they were talking about who they should hire. And he, the guy that I met, walked by them. Oh, what? The shop. Yeah, yeah. And then, and then Julie went out and asked him. She was like, "Do you know anyone that would be good for this, uh, for this Aww. job of like being on camera?" And he had met me one time, like, and this Dang. was this was Haley. two this was two months after I met him. Yeah. Two months later. Wow. That impression though. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, he apparently said that I would be a good fit yeah. after meeting once, which Dang. is really Aww. cool. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, it is crazy. Yeah. Ailey, Ailey must have had some kind of. Yeah, you know that was saying? like guardian angel. I'm saying something like that. Oh, it was like man very, was, man very, was minimal, very minimal. Very minimal. Two chances. months later. Two months. Man later. was like, so yo, was that one chick, she, she's <laughs> working on that language, but man. She's good <laughs> job, I was uh, so I was working at Nordstrom at that time, and he texted me. He's like, he's like, my, I, I'm friends with like this, uh, the uh, boss at this gaming mm -hmm. company, and they're starting a YouTube channel, and they want someone who can be on camera. And I, I texted back, and I was like, oh, I, I wouldn't be right for that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I wouldn't be good at that. I don't have any experience. I was applying to like random things. I was yeah. working at Nordstrom for the time being. Yeah. Um. So yeah, this job really. It, I feel very settled in this job now, which I didn't expect. Yeah. Um. So yeah, this kind of became a new, 
a new passion of mine that I've acquired through through the, That's through a great the college admissions so what are your interview. Goals? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what what would you like ten years from now? Obviously outside of like oh home, whatever. Like what do you want to be doing? That's a great question. I have no idea now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This, Ma, this, this uh, threw a wrench in my life, but it, well, it's, not, it's taken mean, it in a great direction. I was going to say, that's not a bad thing. You know, yeah. you, it's not a bad thing to not have it figured out. I mean, listen, I don't have it figured out. I'm way older than you two. And not way not older. Way I'm old. a little bit older. Yeah, he's way older. I'm he's like 30. 25. Way older. -ish. Our senior in life. <laughs> I really look up to. Haley and Mark, I saw them looking for uh, old person homes for me to live in <laughs> outside. We're, we're just looking ahead. <laughs> like, yeah. Wait, it's having some issues. A couple more years. He's barely <laughs> A couple more years. <laughs> All right, Mark. What do you got? Mark? Um, That's a hard question. I mean, I've always like wanted to retire early. Like for, 40. <laughs> Like 40s, okay, or 50s. So that's your dream. So I really want to like get into like I want to start like a business, get into real estate, make some passive income. If this thing goes well, I would like want to do it like buy the company. Okay, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> Become Andrew's boss. <laughs> oh, and then ask him for his timesheets every single day. <laughs> I like Every, that idea. Get mad. <laughs> get mad if, it's, if two are sent in one email, you're done. <laughs> you're done. <laughs> you're done, Andrew. You're done. Okay, okay. Yeah. I um, really hope, like, this is, like, we do well yeah. within, like, Gmail, so yeah. we could, like, you know, hopefully be able to be here for years and years on end. Too. Years and, and years, years. I can see years. this. I can see this. I'll keep going. Yeah. Years and years. <laughs> All the reaction like, videos. each other's weddings. Can you imagine? That'd be so cute. Um, I think me, my, I think my biggest goal now for a long time is be to get into a commentator role, to, to either really make it with a podcast. I'm, I'm always wanting to start a podcast. I've started a podcast, but it's not really a podcast. It's just me talking about fights. <laughs> um, to, and then getting blasted on stream, doing wagers when I try to predict fights. I did seven tequila shots on stream today, oh and God. I don't drink. Wow, that's insane. Yeah, it was not. It was not. Uh, it was a good night. It's gonna be the next slumber party stream. We're gonna go that hard. Um, yeah, yeah. The, the the goal for me has always been to work <clears throat> in sports. Whether it was, I mean, I think the the opportunity with with G Mini was open the, the door to esports, which I didn't really consider for a long time, and then esports <laughs> kind of blew up, and I I've been a fan of some of the games that have blown up, and then become a fan of games that. You know, we play here, like, League and Overwatch. And while I might not know exactly what I'm talking about, it just helps me, like, continue to, to form, like, an on-camera. Just It's like a repetition for me to stay on camera, to be able to, to mold myself into a role and, and yeah. start to, like, I don't know, build things together and, and have be fluid with things and, and test myself and put myself in situations I wouldn't <clears throat> normally be in. The ultimate goal for me is to work with, like, a... a a big company like G Minio is that company. If it's you know something with the UFC, I've always wanted to work in fighting. Yeah, uh, something like that. But I yeah, I can really see you doing that. I can see you in like a commentator position. That's especially. what I want to do. That's, That's what, what I want to do. You're, you're so great at that. Like when I was editing the videos, like man, like Wade's so good yeah, at this. Yeah. Even if there's nothing you going on, you find something to talk about. A lead caster. Yeah. I feel like I could. I mean, not probably not league, just because I don't know the like yeah, the names. Yeah, you know more about the games. Because I called the Baron Reverse Dragon. There you go. That's content right there. That's content. <laughs> That's content. That's what yeah. they're looking for. That's what they're looking for. <laughs> that pro esports. Well, who knew us three noobs can like get into? I mean, yeah. not really. We, e well, we put on. Like, <laughs> listen, listen, us four. Second we, most popular uh, esports tournament That's behind true. LCS, I believe. Yes. No, we, we sorry, stomp worlds. on LCS. LCS, you want LCS. that smoke? Come and find us, G Mini. Oh my boy. <laughs> This is not but, good relationship building. <laughs> LCK. Uh, all you other ones, yes. Uh, LCS. We'll do business. Um, <laughs> next question. Okay, let's move on to the second question. So we didn't get through all of Mana Junkie's questions last time. I want to go back to those. We're okay. Mana Sims. There are four more. But four. one of them one of them he did ask what our dream jobs were. And he also said, if you say G-Minio, I'll cry. So none That's of us said G-Minio. G-Minio. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. But yeah, like, yeah, yeah. It would be such a dream yeah, of course. if we came here every single day and just acted ourselves it's and so got true. paid for it. It's so true. And, like, I I talk about this all the time, but, like, imagine how many people would just, like, 
love our jobs. I yeah. think about that a lot. Oh, yeah. Yeah, just, no, like, the, coming in and, and have the like, learning video too. games and yeah. being able to build a channel and build a community. It's just, it's been a blast, so. Yeah. Um, I would, like, I, I think it's a lot more fun being on a YouTube channel with, like, two other people than it is. Doing it by yourself. Yeah, you've talked about that before. 100%. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I, I find that struggle, Mark, obviously, has, has had more success with it, but I find that struggle, like, I have run a podcast off and on, and it's because I get burned out. It is um, on my YouTube channel. It's an MMA podcast, but when you're in front of the, the camera by yourself, you're the one that's editing in post. You're the one that's making your own thumbnails. You're the one that's that's doing all of the audio and video for yourself. There's no producer. How is that different from now? <laughs> well, we help each other, yeah, and, yeah. and Andrew helps with that. Andrew's like our, our whole set yeah, design, yeah. you know. And then we have Kelly as well, who, who does great work. Um, that stuff burns you out because you're sitting in front of this camera for an hour just talking to it, mm-hmm. and you mm-hmm. hope that, that you're getting your point across the right way. You hope yeah. you're saying things that, that it's focus, relay, yeah, that you don't ramble, good. Yeah. all that thing. And it's I imagine just... it would be hard not having people to like bounce ideas exactly. off Exactly. And, yeah. and you have like different people in chat and stuff, but it, it's just not the same as having like a group mm-hmm. of friends that you can kind of come in and, and, like you said, it's we get to work. It, it doesn't even feel like work, and then by yeah. the end of it, we're we're like, oh, we, we're doing something. We're getting paid to do it, but we're having a blast. So. Plus, yeah. I think the <clears throat> the great thing about you know working all together is that we we share our successes and we share our failures. Mm-hmm. So if if something doesn't so work with deep. the channel, it's not. <laughs> thank you. It's <laughs> not. It's not only. It's not just one of our faults. Like we don't have to take full responsibility <laughs> for it. But we also. <laughs> <laughs> just like. <laughs> Yeah, nothing coming out. Yes, that. Yeah. Most of it, if it doesn't have, like one day I posted a video that didn't have a title. Or it said, <laughs> yeah, that was it funny. Said, we caught it really fast, but it just said it was like. It said reaction. <laughs> it was just like reaction, and there was no other title. <laughs> it was like, why does the title just say reaction? And my heart like for, dropped. I was like, oh. It was it's for so reunion funny. reaction, and someone oh commented gosh. really fast, and they were like, why does the title just say reunion reaction? I was like, wow, you're quick to this video. <laughs> the Overwatch people get there so quick. <laughs> the video is not still processing, and people are like, first, first, first. It's a cult. Oh, we, and I, I think I put, I was just like, oh, we share our failures. But then I think I responded to that comment, and I was like, Wayne has a change. <laughs> I was like, Wayne has a change. The title. <laughs> oh, my gosh. You just threw him under the bus, <laughs> huh? <laughs> okay, <Sorry>. never mind. <laughs> There's been yeah. no one person that's been responsible. I think it's been everybody that's that's been able to, and that's not just us. That's you guys that's been able to build this community. Like, without the the, the work that like you guys do in Discord and the comments section, um, you guys have reached out to other YouTubers in in lieu of oh, us. Yeah, that's so great. that's that's pretty insane. Uh, and hopefully we're going to 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 make you guys proud with, with yeah. collaborating more. We definitely want to do that. Yeah. yeah. So a job it doesn't feel like a job. No. Is that exactly. for... another one of management these questions? Uh, what were your first jobs, and do you think they taught you oh, any valuable God. lessons as a worker? Is that where Haley got her work oh. ethic? <laughs> that where Haley got her this work seems ethic. Like, this seems like another way question. No, 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 no. Go ahead. <laughs> what was your first My job? My first job was as a lifeguard, which I've Oh, that we, we talked, talked about yesterday. Yeah, yeah, I've talked to you guys. Haley and I could have passed each other, like you see in those movies, mm-hmm. where you meet someone years later, but you already maybe have met them. Yeah. Haley could have been wagging her finger at me, being like, don't run. <laughs> In the deep end, sir. <laughs> there's ki- there's children abound. I uh, yeah, I worked at Where like your a, floaties at, sir. <laughs> I worked at a pool that was, it's called like the beach club. Beach so club. it has like it's it's a really dangerous pool, mm-hmm. so there were a ton of rules, so everybody hated the lifeguards. Yeah. And um and apparently Wade like lived there and he went there a couple times. So I was not there. lived there. I lived at the oh, beach club. Yeah. <laughs> he lived in that area. <laughs> I lived in the corner of the, the sand trap. I built my own tent. <laughs> <laughs> they had to come over and be like, sir, you have to go. No, I lived in the neighborhood that the beach club was in, and I guess I might have seen Haley. Yeah, because I worked insane. there. I worked this there is as a small teenager. world. Yeah. I know. Isn't yeah. that crazy? You know how you got the job and everything? I know. Yeah, that's beach. wild. What was your first job, Mark? Uh, so it was actually when I was 13. I'm not going <laughs> to say where, because now thinking about it, it might be illegal. <laughs> but um, I was. Um, what did you do? <laughs> Hold on, I'm getting to it. <laughs> I was a wardrobe theater uh, assistant. Oh, okay. So I like... Where? I'm not going to say oh, where. Right, right, right. <laughs> oh, yeah, you so like, I had to like um, sew a couple things. For, so like, was, was this in show. Texas or here? It was here. Oh, it was an Texas. internship. Oh, an you internship. You didn't get paid. I got paid, kind of. But I also worked in a theater when I was like 14. <laughs> so weird. That's I think how they, they get paid you. us in food. I mean, <laughs> 
it's kind of a tight deal. Yeah. But I guess like my first real, real job that I'm not afraid to say was like at Old Navy. You know, I had a good oh, job. I was like the greeter. Everybody else had to like. Oh, those people that have to work at the register, I feel so bad yeah. for them. Because when you get to Old Navy, you know how the register set up. There's usually only two people at the register. Mm-hmm. And there's like five registers, right? So there's two people there, and there's a big, long line of people, and everybody gets in the line together, yeah. regardless if you're buying anything or not. Yeah. Like, you know how families will just get in the line together. <laughs> so it's like the line goes out the door, and these poor so two old stressful. Navy workers are just trying to pull the tags off and, like, scan yeah. the pool. And I'm like, oh, man, I feel so bad. Especially at the Spectrum. I feel so bad for oh, those yeah. people, man. Or the people yeah. that are folding the clothes, because someone just walks right up, picks the clothes up, looks at it, oh, yeah. and then just, like, wads it up and puts it back down. Yeah. That's that's something I'm sure you knew that's a lot about. That's something I know a lot about. And they don't, they, they'll look you dead in your, like, dead in your eyeballs and be like, yeah, they'll be like, <laughs> they don't give any flows. Like, whatever, dude. They do not. Um, I can tell a million stories about that. Haley's <laughs> we'll Nordstrom stories are coming, we'll podcast. Keep it at bay. Um, my the first job. Service workers. Yes, yeah, yes. Absolutely. I worked in, in retail. It is not fun. Um, I, my first job, I was, <laughs> I worked at the Parks and Recreation uh, in my local hometown. It was like a town of 2,500 people. That's where oh, I yeah? grew up. Mm-hmm. And we had a, uh, a rec, obviously a parks and rec, and I worked as an umpire for oh. adult league softball. Now, if okay. you guys have ever ever seen adult league softball, it gets very competitive. So imagine 16-year-old Wade being an umpire and has to call outs and safes for grown men grown and women men? that are reliving <laughs> their glory so days. So what's an, an umpire? An, so it's like, you know, the guy in, in baseball is like, you're out. Oh, like, you're like, you're safe. There's one behind the plate, and then there's one in the field that can, like, call who's oh, out so and safe. So, like, people. if something's, like, vague or, like, you're not sure who got, you mm-hmm. know... Like if someone, it's a really close play, and someone steps on the base, and they catch the ball close yeah. to the same time. And the time, umpire has to watch has to... really carefully and call it. Yeah, I'm so gay. That was... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, real cool story. I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. That you're an umpire, but guess what? <laughs> I'm gay. I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool, sweetheart. And I'm gonna let you finish. <laughs> um, yeah. So That's that stressful. was it. Was interesting, and I had buddies that had a team. Mm-hmm. So some of my best friends to this day, I talk to them every day. They had their own team. So when they would play and I would be there, and again, we're in a small town, everybody knows everybody. If I called something remotely close in their favor, people were ready to riot. Wow. They were ready to just come out wow. on the field and imagine. beat my ass. I can <laughs> like, imagine. Did you ever get injured? I never got like in a fight or anything. There were some people, some, some guys that tried, but I was a minor, and obviously yeah. you can't fight minors, adults. Parents, um, parents get really yeah, competitive it was that same thing. kids, too. It was, their, it was that same type of thing. Because yeah. I would have to I would have to umpire some of the kids' uh, machine pitch games. And you'd have parents, not coaches, not the guys that were supposed to be conversating with the umpire. You'd have parents screaming, coming through, you and that, my, my son was safe, all this. Uh, and that was the mom. That was a deep voice woman. <laughs> That was a very deep voice lady. Oh, That's my God. Was yeah, she was coming at me like, you know what I'm saying, like, a rhino. <laughs> I was not. Basically, I, I got a very uh, early introduction to what angry people at a workplace would be. Yeah. Yeah. But it wasn't. It wasn't too bad, man. I got paid a little bit. I got to put gas in my car. Um, <laughs> I, I think this would be a good question, but I'll, I'll wait. I was gonna say what your guys' first cars were. I, don't I remember. still have my first car. I don't remember. You still have your first car? Yeah, yeah. What is it? It's a Kia. Oh, that. Yeah, yeah. Piece of shit ass one. So I actually, <laughs> <laughs> I've actually had three cars. One was like okay, a, bougie. a great car. One was like a nice, like a really great car. Nice car. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like I'm gay. My car is gray. <laughs> that's me too. My I'm, like, I'm like, like my. It's white. <laughs> that's the model. It's a great car. That's the model. <laughs> 2009 great car. <laughs> and then I had another car, like a really current car, and that's like my favorite car. Do you know? And I the... crashed it. How? It was like a, oh no. Um, well, I didn't crash it. My stepdad did. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, so now I have a Prius. And I'm Prius. saving up for another car. Tesla. What kind of car yes. do you want? He's You're going to get Tesla? I want to. It's my you and Jason car. are going to have matching Teslas? Yes. Sick. Oh I mean, that's tight. That's bougie. That's tight, though. It doesn't depreciate, so it's good. The value. Okay. So. And. Why doesn't it depreciate? It doesn't depreciate as much. Because it's an energy car. Ugh. Oh. It's like uh, a bang car, uh, like the bang uh, version of a car. <laughs> uh, I my first car was a 1996 Jeep Cherokee. I bought it for eight hundred dollars after selling a go kart. Wow, really? Yeah. Wow. After selling a go kart and a couple other things, and then my mom pitched in and helped Aww. like the last half. Oh. And so nice uh, 
I got I turned 16. This I found out this is different than out here a little bit. I turned 16 and on the day I turned 16. I went and got my license, or I went and got my yeah my license, and I started driving that day by myself. Wait, really? Wait I think we had the same car. I think that was the car. Uh, Jeep Cherokee. I think. The oh, box it was a oh, it's a Jeep. Oh, never mind. Yeah, Jeep Cherokee. <laughs> I'm okay. like, Jeep maybe. Cherokee, and Mark's like, same car, and then I say, no, it was a Jeep Cherokee. Oh, completely different. <laughs> different car. <laughs> I was like, oh okay. my goodness. He's like, not great. Cool. <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, so that was. It had dents and it had scratches all in it, but that car was like my favorite thing. The, the the AC didn't work. I've had three cars, and the AC hasn't worked in two of them. Aww. But, oh my goodness. Yeah. I had a stick shift uh, up until I got the, the Ford Focus outside. Yeah, mine had like a big slash. Yeah. My first car had a big yeah. slash across it. Yeah. Really? That was great. <laughs> <laughs> it was my aesthetic. <laughs> <laughs> I like this one. Okay. I don't know if I should, I have to read these. Is it Mana? Yeah. Does Mark give you all horoscope readings every day? Do Haley, Wade, and Andrew believe in astrology? Mm. See? Andrew, okay, give, me hey. a, give me a nod first. You believe in astrology? No. Andrew said. Here's, here's and like you the slow full, nodded too, and yo. Andrew slow nodded on that, that. That was a disrespectful no, son. Okay, no, no. This is the Andrew wasn't flavor. like. Like, like, I don't Mark take astrology, astrology super, super, super seriously. Like, a lot of people in the ast- astrology okay. community, I just, it's just fun, you know? Of all the people that I that <laughs> I know that are into astrology, Mark is the least Mark into is it. the least into it. And the thing is, like, I thought you were going to be it's really into silly. it when I saw your channel, because I have a lot of friends that are into astrology. And, like, you've never talked about it. Ever and like yeah. I don't want to I don't want I, just I don't want your fun. astrology fans to hear this. But like, Zodiacs. No, no, I you didn't say a word I, about you. No, no, I I tell them you know like this is this channel is just, just for fun. You be. know like it you shouldn't be. like yeah, base. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's a lot deeper than that, like real astrology. But um, I don't go to that. Level. Mark doesn't yeah. talk. About, I just do it for fun. We talk about being a Gemini sometimes. He's yeah. asked me once. And I, I don't even remember what I am, but he I think he asked me once. So to answer your question, man, I don't know. Like I don't. I don't know if I believe in it because I don't even know what I am. You're Just, a Libra. I thought he would be a Leo or an Aries. Libra? A Libra. Like a zebra? That's crazy. Yeah, like a zebra. I, you know what? I have I, a lot of stripes. When when people start... I earned my stripes. <laughs> when people started getting really into astrology in like late high school or whatever that was, I remember Gemini's were getting so much hate that I was just I was just yeah. completely, I was like, it was a wall. I was like, I'm not getting into astrology. People are so mean to Gemini's. Because Donald Trump is a Gemini. A lot of it actually like makes sense, you know. Like Donald Trump's a Gemini. Haley's a Gemini. (laughs) Gemini. (laughs) And yeah. (laughs) Make your own conclusions, guys. Is that what people are doing in late high school? Because you're intimidating. Am I? I don't and like. You have a way about you that people do not understand. Who, I don't me? think that's true. I don't think either of those I'm pretty are simple. Right. You're a pretty approachable person. Mark thought I was going to kick his ass because he was no, gay. No, Libras that's are true. like. Supposed to be. Never mind. Maybe go ahead. No, go ahead. I want to know. Do you not know? They're supposed to be like flirt, flirty, and. Am I flirty? Mr. They're flirty Wade. Be, yeah, am like, am I, like, I, come in, I come into the office. Actually, that makes sense. The shirt sense. gets ripped now, off. I'm thinking about it. How? They're supposed to be like big womanizers. I'm not a womanizer at all. Wait, how he's been faithful to his girlfriend for like no. whatever five years. Yeah. Shout out to Mana Junkies. Thank you for the questions. We're big awesome. mana simps here at Jim and Neil. Yeah, we, we simp simps. we simp a lot of mana. Um Love Mana. It sounded weird when I said it for some reason. But thank you, Mana. Perfect. Nevertheless, you are a, a fantastic mod and a great, great member of this community. Everybody in chat loves, everybody in Discord respects and loves, and we do as well. True. So no mamoots says, are you guys ever going to go to the console platform? Because some games like Overwatch don't have cross-platform capabilities like other games. Um, we may be able to like buy a console game here or someone it brings de- theirs. <laughs> it depends. Um, I have both consoles. I have an Xbox One. I have a PlayStation 4. Andrew has a Switch. Um, we, we would probably do it on occasion. The reason that we stay on PC is because something we all have. It's a pretty easy medium for everybody that, that plays games that we would play here. Yeah. Like... League and, and Overwatch. I grant now Overwatch does have a, a console form that isn't cross-platform for some reason. Um, but you know other games that we want to play most are on PC. But I think for occasions like we did with the Slumber Party stream, we would move to console. Yeah. And uh, yeah. and do that. But I don't I don't know I don't I don't know if never if, say never. Yeah, never say never. I don't know if that's something we'll, we'll going take a look at. Yeah, I, I would say more probable for for uh, the future than right now. Yeah, probably probable. Probably, prob- probable. Probably, probable. Okay, McCree 
another fantastic Cree. member of our Discord. How you doing, Cree? Um, Kriege asks, you. so if you want to make your own unique characters combining some abilities from the in-game Overwatch characters, what does everybody's character look like? Ooh. Wait. Okay. So they have to, they, it's his ability base, not physical looks base. Like the ability space. Can we do physical looks base and ability base? Sure. Are okay. you going to pick Tracers? Okay. Yep. Okay. Uh, I'm giving the Fanny of Tracer, because she got that cake, you know his name? Um, I want the voice of McCree. No, I want the voice of Roadhog. You want the you want Road Tracer's Road. ass with McCree's voice? I, why can't I have Roadhog's voice? Yeah. So you want Roadhog to be I want him built like Reinhardt, but with the ass of Tracer, with the voice of Roadhog. Oh my god! And the abilities. <laughs> what sounds, is this abomination that, that you created? That sounds frightening. <laughs> and the abilities. I think of, that's a sin way. <laughs> I want I want I want a, I want a Roadhog hook because I like doing the Roadhog hooks. But then I want a um. I want a, uh, what's it called? A six shooter of McCree. So you hook him and then you just, and all six. And then the ultimate, the ultimate is, um, the ultimate is, um, oh, I want to be able to heal like Roadhog too. Yeah. And the ultimate can be I sit on people. You, you, that sounds Tracer's like, <laughs> yeah. Sounds like you want to be a dominatrix. <laughs> <laughs> With a really deep voice. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we know what Wade's into now. <laughs> I, well, I don't know what what would be a cool like thing because I have a gun and a hook. It's I like throw my latex, hook. Latex, leather. Wait, I got it. I take my gun. I put the hook on the little gun hook, and I go fishing with the hook like it's a gun. Go. And then when I pull it back, it shoots. Okay. I don't think you guys can beat that. The I body think... of Ryan, the the butt of Tracer, voice of Roadhog, a hook, and a six shooter. I think Moira's pretty perfect that she is. Mark just likes no, the no, suck ability. Yeah, no, no, no. This is what I would do. This is what I, do. I would do. I would take Mora, give her turrets. The turrets can do sucking. Sucking turrets. Sucking turrets. And then what do go. they do once they suck? It's them? a combination of Torb and Mora. Okay. More Torb. Torbra. Torbra. What is that? What is the? What is the sucking from the turrets? It's just like sucking their life force everywhere. All the turrets. Mm, I don't know. Or like Asa vacuuming turret. their <laughs> items <laughs> off. <laughs> Ask the, the turrets. turrets. That's not my jurisdiction. <laughs> um, okay. Ailey? For me, I think I would have, like, a healer ability with, mm -hmm. like, D.Va or something, and then have, like, the ability to inflict damage that Junkrat has. Mm. Yeah. So it's like a D.Va that can heal people. A D.Va that can throw out bombs. Okay. And then she can also heal people. But and then, but her ult's the same, because I like her ult. So what's the whole point so of she having can't... a team game? <laughs> <laughs> but but jump right, so you can't use the tire. Where's the tire? That's what the word. So it'll be tank damage and support all in one. We can, yeah. we can have a tire somewhere in there. She has we to have, have like a, when she explodes, like a tire tires pops fly out. out everywhere. Right, uh, and if you're in the vicinity, your rubber meets has the road. A, she has a spare tire on the back of her <laughs> on the back of her mat. And she's walking around going, <laughs> "Hey, did like, your car break down? <laughs> I work with AAA. I can I can help you." That's her healer ability. She, she, brings, healer she brings in a tow truck. She comes in with a AAA uniform. <laughs> She's all, "Do you have you used your allowed in four pickups this year? <laughs> if so, it's gonna be an extra." <laughs> I like that. I think you guys didn't do the physical thing like I did. I made an abomination oh, of a human. You did the physical thing for sure. <laughs> you can't tell me someone throwing a gun out and hooking it back to shoot it isn't dope. I would also like the hook. That's bullshit, man. I, I can't even have nothing for myself. <laughs> I don't want the hook. I, the I don't want them to get closer to me. <laughs> That's a good point. Never mind. I'll Mark's like, turn, 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 turn. Oh, you know, what, you know what I'll take is Reinhardt's shield. Oh, there oh, you go. Oh, she's invincible. Hmm. I'm already a tank. And Hay Haley would shield. use the shield and then <laughs> use her ult and shield her own ult from everybody. <laughs> That's true. I would probably do that. She can ult shield and it blows up in her face. Okay, this is a, a deep question from Raymond. Ray Fang. Um, deep. Raymond. Question for Q&A. A, a deep one. Like that? This is a deep question. Okay, I'm, I'm ready. Let's get if deep. If your younger self saw you now... Wait, why did my Siri come on? If, if your younger self saw you now, would they be surprised? Yeah. I say yes. Yeah. I think my... my this is like not going to sound great, but I think my younger self would be disappointed in me. What? Yeah. Really? Why? Because yeah. my younger self wanted to play football in the NFL. Oh. I, that was my dream was to play football in the NFL. I wanted to play for University of Tennessee. I didn't do that. So that was the first disappointment to younger self. And then I wanted to play in the NFL. I thought you did play for University. Of I played Tennessee Tech, which is a smaller oh, okay. school. That's <laughs> not Tennessee. Did you get a Did you get a scholarship? I did at Tennessee Tech. There you go. But I wanted to play for like 
it's a fandom that you got like Mark has for league skins. I'm assuming like you don't you don't watch a lot of sports. Do you have a sports team that you're like God? I have to see them Mark every likes, time. They're... Mark likes league, mm-hmm. likes SKT. sports. Okay. Uh, oh, no, no, no. TSM. TSM. So like when I was a kid, there was nothing that I would rather do than watch Tennessee football on a Saturday. I've told you guys about how my dad's mind worked and how that made my mind work. Like. Yeah. I was so I wanted to be a Tennessee football player so bad. My room was clad in orange Aww. and white. Oh. I had everything. So yeah. I, th- I think he would be disappointed. I think he'd be surprised. I think I, he would be. Uh, I don't know. There'd be like a silver lining there that I didn't have to do something that I felt like was was like a trade off. Yeah, like, like I didn't have yes. to do something where I felt like my life was going down that path. That's what I was gonna have to do. If I didn't do that, it's a complete failure. I realize now that it wasn't. Like there was just something else I could do. You mm-hmm. know? So. Yeah. At first, he'd be disappointed. Secondly, he'd be like, "Let's play video games." Well, that's life. It is and life. My, my my I think my brother feels the same way because my brother's growing up want to be want, my oldest brother wanted to be a professional golfer. Mm-hmm. And he was kind of on on his way to do that. And both of my brothers were, were on their way. My brother also played football for a smaller school. He was the mm-hmm. quarterback. Mm-hmm. And then, um, yeah, just you know, things change. That's the thing. Is like it, you you put so much time into it as a kid, and yeah. then like I did it, like I'm sure your brothers did for 16 years, and then you go, oh. Well, what? This is over now. What do I do? Yeah, you know, it's like you really have That's a lack hard. of skills built outside of it, and you're like, okay, well, let's figure out what I want to do. But I don't think I think like I said, my younger self would be disappointed at first, but then I think he would just be like, oh, dope. Okay, let's let's go play video games, and I would smash him for thinking he could. Help me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, Mark. Mark. Um. I mean, like, I'm always like insecure about like you know where I'm at right now if I'm doing enough, but I guess like. My younger self would be, like, really happy to be where I am right now because, like, I don't know, whenever I, when I was young, I was always, like, groomed to, like, you know, be the best. I got accepted to, like, a med school. You know, did? Uh, med high. It's a high school that okay. teaches, like, it grooms you for, like, being a doctor and all that stuff. Mm-hmm. And that was, like, all my, like, dad's dream. Um, and c- I guess, like, when, like, my mom and my dad had a divorce, I was kind of more free to kind of choose what I wanted to do. And that's, like, I... I've always wanted to do like YouTube and get into entertainment, fashion, things like that, and I guess that's what I'm doing right now. So I'm I'm pretty happy. Nice. Yeah, that's where I'm at. That's the cool thing. It's like the 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 entire argument of what you were meant to, or like what you're supposed to do, what your parents tell you you're supposed to do versus what you choose to do is always an interesting thing. Like I don't know if ever I really ch- I'm like yeah I wanted to play football, but was it because I wanted to play football or is it because it was like yeah you're playing football, you know, and then you become so ingrained in it that it's something that you think like yeah I want to do and then finally I got to the point where I was like do I want to do it Mm -hmm. so it's cool Mark found that out very quickly and turned down med high yeah oh I got accepted but that's what I'm saying you turned it down you were like yeah bye see ya (laughs) when you said med high I thought of sky high the Disney movie (laughs) I would have been balling if I got into sky high (laughs) I would have been you know what would have happened Uh, well Haley obviously you tell yours and then I don't want to go off on a tangent and interrupt yours okay um I feel like, yeah, I feel like my childhood self would be happy with where I'm at now, just nice. because uh, when I was a kid, I was really into, like, theater and mm-hmm. stuff, and I loved, like, performing. It was really fun. That was, like, where I met a lot of my friends as a kid, um, and I fell out of that and, and kind of got into other things when I went to high school, and I got super, super into academics. Like, I I absolutely loved my major in college, and it was, like, it was what I was really art focused history. on. <laughs> Not art history, actually. <laughs> it was history. And then... Um, and yeah, so to now I feel like I'm kind of falling back into like what you wanted to do in the first yeah, place. Yeah, when I was a kid. So I think my I think my childhood self would be stoked because I, I I for some reason I was like kind of a I was kind of a nihilistic kid. I was like I was like that's never gonna work out. Like because everyone I knew at that time, all the friends I made, really wanted to be actors, and a lot of them kept going. Mm. And I was like, if all these people are doing it, there's no way. Right. Okay. That I, yeah. I could so you ever, like already kind of myself realistic st- mindset. Yeah. And then you came back to it, and now look at you. And now I'm actually like, really good those... theater. Because like when I first saw your video, I was like, wow, she really knows a lot about video games. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and then I found out she was acting. <laughs> and her skill shot speaks for that. Oh, my Mark God. Mark walked in the first day, and Haley went, in scene. <laughs> and you're like, now I'm like, wow. <laughs> I'm to K-pop. I'm to K-pop. Yeah, this is the last question. Okay. Actually, there's two more. <laughs> Wait. He asked a question, and he said, never mind. <laughs> who's who's is, who's man? This is a frog man, and then in parentheses, ulu. A frog man. A frog man. Okay. So, Fun fact: my my middle school nickname was frog. Really? Why? I jumped really high. Oh man, the air conditioning's messed up again. Shut up. Okay. 
imagine. <laughs> Here's a question. Who's the most childish in the group? And then he said, he said never mind who would win if you had a oh. fight to the death. So those are two very different Wade. questions. I would obviously win <laughs> any fights to the death. Um, one, probably because I'm not afraid to die in any oh my situation. Goodness. Uh, who's the most childish is, I think, a better question. These two. It's between me and you. It has to be. No, I think it's you two. No what? way. Haley's no. the most quiet. Haley has, no. she'll laugh at I'm her jokes. I'm always in the middle of you two I'll whenever you guys argue. You, like, no, listen. Mark is what's called what I am to my friends. I'm just a troll. I'm the agitator to my friends. I'm the one that riles people up and gets them going. Mark, when I start going, he'll feed. He'll feed me more. He'll continue <laughs> to keep me going. I think it's probably Mark. Yeah. No. Like, I, I feed in league. Mark feeds me when I start with the childish <laughs> I jokes. I feed in league. But if if Haley starts to, Mark, like, he doesn't feed, but he, like, you know, he's, like, encourages. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go away. Keep going. Yeah. See? So I'm still the youngest one, though, so. It's also, it also Dang, that was a shot at you, Haley, by the way. <laughs> Mark's one day younger than me. Congratulations. <laughs> it's not Three. Andrew. Andrew's not the childish one. He's the one that... This... Andrew named his team BDSM. That's true. Yeah. I mean, that's Mark, childish. But Mark named his team Team Suck. That's true. I would... Listen, I, I'm childish to, to get to make people laugh, but at the end of the day, I'm very mature. Remember he used to put the fart noises? Oh, that's true. And he called you but farting But you laughed Haley. at it. No, I didn't call her, I call her Gassy Haley. Gassy Haley. <laughs> We're still working on a Gassy Haley emote, guys. It's coming out. <laughs> that was pretty Wait. funny. A Gassy Haley emote would be fire. Fire. <laughs> See, I, I'll just enable her. Yeah. Wait, Mark's just enable. So I guess older brother We're than equal. I We're had. equal in... Or equal oh, in you guys are partners in, in crime for the childish parts, and I'm partners, the one partners like, in child. <laughs> for partners in child. <laughs> what did I say? You said partners in. <laughs> partners in childishness. Childishness okay. partners. See, this okay. is what I'm talking about. All right, last. You said you had one more. Uh, yeah, it? one more. Who would win if you all had a fight to the oh, death? Well, me. I really like that question. It's very straightforward. Yeah. I I would like to think that I would win, but I would probably lose. It, it, this would have to be. I would the, really want to win though. You you could though. What like I I I would look at it as a very like hand to hand fight. But if you're smart enough, you would stay away from me. And I would definitely start by hiding. But then if someone found me, I would just I would freak out and I would scream and I would die. <laughs> yeah. Freak out, I, I could run and pretty die. fast. Yeah, Mark could probably run away. Haley, well, you have you long legs. You four, can probably minute, swim. You said you're a swimmer. <laughs> Find water. Oh, that's true. Actually. What is this map looking like that we have to fight to the death? In? It's basically <laughs> it's battle royale. It's battle basically royale. the the layout of the Irvine spectrum. We're fighting <laughs> in the spectrum. So I'm just gonna so hop in the you're fountain. You're hopping in the fountain and swimming back. And, and you're forth. like, it's not that deep, Haley. Walk. <laughs> Haley's swimming last. It's like, please don't see me. Please don't see me. Where can I Andrew, hide? Andrew, Andrew might. I know the map of the Irvine spectrum probably the best. There you go. I don't know though. Kelsey goes there a lot. I know a lot Are of the Are you going to console with Kelsey? We're being dropped in there today. By no, her. but I'm saying I have to walk <laughs> around with her. Like, where would you guys hide in the Irvine spectrum? In the Irvine spectrum. I think How long do? What if we? Okay, what if it times out after 24 hours? And if no one finds each other, we all just get to. Yeah, we all come together. I, I shake everyone's hands like, "Great job, Should everyone!" And then kill and you like, all. Pew. Yeah. Because that, that's that would be you would kill us after the time has run out just for fun. But how do you know? But how do I know? Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Is this 24 hours? Is it? No, he didn't say any of that. He That's what I'm saying. I, we would make it. We is would this make a threat? It. What if, what if <laughs> Andrew locked this us? door right now? Oh, and shit. And we have to fight in here. TV, <laughs> camera, mic in the Mark's face. <laughs> I'll just walk through that door. Light, bash him in the head. <laughs> I, I, checked the, the I checked the magic eight ball. Does Andrew deserve to live? Toss that like a fastball. <laughs> and then GG. <laughs> so, guys, that is our podcast for the day. Episode three. Um, if you're new here... The G-Minio Let's Play, obviously our main channel, G-Minio. Go check us out over there. Stay here for great content, highlights, streams, uh, personalized content, and these podcasts. These are something that are really, like, we're really passionate about these. We just started them. Uh, we're super excited. You guys seem to be uh, excited about it as well. Make sure you like and subscribe here. And in the audio realm, if you guys are driving in the car, uh, if you're doing something where you can't watch the video, uh, make sure you subscribe on Spotify. Leave us a, a rating and review. That will really help out the podcast. Mm -hmm. Uh, G Minio Podcast is our working title. We're still thinking of a, of a pretty saucy name. We have G Minio Let's Talk. We have Wham, which would be what? Wade, Wham Wham Haley. Idea. I'm G Minio Let's Talk. Okay, G Minio Let's Talk, Wham. Versus Wham. So versus it's Mark Wham. versus me. In the comments let section, us know. let us know. Do you guys like Wham, which would be Wade, Haley, Andrew, Mark, or G Minio Let's Talk? Wham FM. Wham FM. I like Wham FM. I, I kind of like it now, too. With that being said, um, 
Yeah, that's the podcast. Thank you to everyone that asked questions, and yeah, we will see you next time. Until then, I'm your host, Wade. I'm Haley. And I'm Mark. And remember, game it till you make it. Bye, guys. <laughs>